Hi, my name is Matthew Jester. Just making a quick video here. So I have my friend Shonda on the line. Um, and hi. She says hi. So I have a certificate of completion here to show that I'm certified and competent in the field of hypnosis. We're just, uh, she's just going to, she's just going to be helping me make the video. So give me just a second and I'll go through the introduction. Please watch my video, Hypnosis, Abuse, and Speech Inhibition. I will leave a link to watch the video in the description. I will also leave additional links in the description of other relevant videos. I've been abused with, hyp with hypnosis and my ability to speak is being inhibited with hypnosis, which is why I have to read everything when I make videos. If you notice me stuttering, speaking slowly, being unable to speak clearly, or any other difficulty speaking, I explain in detail the specific methods and techniques that are being used to inhibit my ability to speak in my video, Hypnosis, Abuse, and Speech Inhibition. These issues speaking occur consistently, consistently in each of my videos, specifically within the first three minutes. The hypnosis inhibiting my ability to speak is often very noticeable throughout my videos, and I will leave a list of the various hypnotic commands that are specifically being used to inhibit my ability to speak that can be recognized in my body language, facial expressions, tone of voice, and speech patterns in the description. So, um, that happened, you know, during the introduction as well, um, very frequently, but anyway, Shonda's actually supposed to help me with that right now. Um, so, what I was, uh, writing, Shonda... Hello? Say that. Say that again. Uh, so what I was writing, um, okay. let's see. The pictures and the letters cued specific metaphors I was told when I was hypnotized, indicating even the pictures John Matthew Harrell drew were pre-mediated. Pretty simple. Right. Right? Right. Okay. And then, let's see. The metaphors were divided into confusing and vague seg segments over several hours, and my memory would be repressed of each metaphor before I was cue to remember the next metaphor um okay yeah keeping up okay so i'm trying to make it like a pretty brief type of description right because i haven't even been able to get into the metaphors yet right yeah so uh let's see this was done to Um, oh wow, the hypnosis is really inhibiting me a lot right now. Um, <clears throat> like, uh, like, you know, this was done to, uh, make the metaphor seem insignificant, um, and to prevent me from writing them down. Right. This was done to make the metaphors... insignificant as evidence so that I wouldn't write it down that was not hard to do so thank you Shonda I appreciate that are you that. okay? what? are you okay? oh hell no um I need to get this done though. Uh, so that's done. And then, um, I guess, let me see. So, um, there might be more that I need to include, but what I have written down is the pictures and the letters skewed specific metaphors. I was told when I was hypnotized, indicating even the pictures John Matthew Hurl drew were pre-mediated. The metaphors were divided into confusing and vague segments over several hours, and my memory would be repressed of each metaphor before I was cued to remember the next metaphor. This was done to make the, um, make the metaphors seem insignificant as evidence so that I wouldn't write it down. Right. Okay. And, let's see, I didn't write the word metaphors down for the second time. Oh no, actually, actually a different word, but regardless, I didn't write the word metaphor down, so I had to write it down, and let me see. The hypnosis is making this so much more difficult than necessary. Um, yeah, I mean, I think I kind of like the way that it's worded. It's pretty simple. Um, I mean, like, it's, I, I've been working on this for days, Shonda. <laughs> this is horrible. Yeah, oh, yeah, like, seriously, this is horrible. So, um, 
let's see, now I could get into uh, what I want to actually do with it, I guess. Um, there is also the aspect, let's see. Wow, okay. Sorry, I noticed this is making this extremely difficult for me. Um, I, I'm going to send you a link to the video to watch after, or try if you want to, but I don't know, it's just us talking, so. Um, you know, it's not really exactly something you might want even want to watch to be honest there's probably better videos that i'll have on the internet um but yeah and let me see so um with the metaphors that i described to you right do you think I need to describe what right. metaphors are to people? Probably not, right? Right. Uh, okay, so... Um, I just had the thought, right? Because, did you watch the first video that I... Um, uh, the first part of the Hypnosis and Drawings video, Shonda? Or not? If I do, I may have to, you may have to send me a link so I can look through it really It's on my Facebook. I'll send it to you. Okay. Let's see, here it I have to send it to you um, in Messenger. Okay. I think you should be able to get it. There we go. Oh, oh I sent it to you. Okay. Did you watch that video? Um, like I said, I'll have to watch it, and I will watch it after. Okay. No worries, no worries. Yeah. Okay. Um, uh, so in that video... Um, you might be able to remember just because I'm going to talk about it right now. So I talked about the hypnotic drawings, or like the drawings that I was hypnotized to draw while I was in jail. And right. the reasons for why they did that. Mm -hmm. Um, so, uh, moving on with that, right? Like, uh, uh um, wow, the hypnosis. Okay, so moving on with that. I can talk about how, like, since... Ah, there we go, there we go. Um, I need to mention how, uh, in the last video, right, um, that I talked about um, how I was hypnotized to draw the pictures on the walls in the jail. And then I could just go into talking about how I was hypnotized to think of the drawings as... That how I was hypnotized to think the drawing on the walls of the jail was um, like hieroglyphs. Right. I actually would probably start out with um, talking about how I was hypnotized to think drawing on the walls of the jail was worshipping the devil. And that investigating the president for committing murder was worshipping the devil. And then talk about the hieroglyphs because, um, you know, like these are all parts of the like things that I was hypnotized to. Um, wow, the hypnosis is making this difficult for me. Um, I mean, like, uh, just talking about the metaphors makes it pretty easy. And then, um, so like, uh, I mean, sorry for being so repetitive, Sean. It's really just the hypnosis. No, it's okay. You're fine. Um, let's see. So, I'm trying to think of how I want to go ahead and proceed with just writing down what I just barely said. I'm, I'm probably going to have to also grab the pictures. Hold on a second.
And, um, so, I'm, I mean, you remember the concept because, like, I was talking about how I was, uh, um, you know, like, cue to think of metaphors with the pictures. And I told you about those two, right? Right. Yeah. So, you know, like, um, <clears throat> I, it's an understandable situation. It's, uh, it should, like, uh, be pretty easy to do. Mm-hmm. Um, and... Like, they did this, um, you know, just so that I wouldn't be able to, uh, break the jail, I guess. Right. Because, uh, you know, like, uh, well, I mean, basically, yeah, uh, a big portion of that. Um, because, you know, they framed me and they didn't want me to, uh, like, uh, basically expose that I was framed. And, you know, Billie Eilish is a celebrity, so it would help to obtain a large amount of publicity over the subject as well. Um, so luckily, you know, like, since I actually care about her, um, you know what I mean, that really works a lot in my favor um, in the situation, because she'd probably be able to help me out too. Um, I kind of felt like I started talking to myself when I was saying that too, which is weird. But I'm recording myself <laughs> at the same time, you know what I mean? The, like, and he's talking to himself. <laughs> Alright, anyway, so like, um, but you, like, uh, <clears throat> wow, and this is really inhibiting me right now. Um, so... The gnosis is really inhibiting me right now. This is ridiculous. Um. You okay? No, I'm not. They have no, like, this is extremely abusive. Right. So, um, yeah, you know, like, uh, <clears throat> moving on, I need to get it done. All right. So, um, I, I can go ahead and, like, uh, I probably won't want to write down what the drawings were and then describe what I'm going to be describing about the drawings, too. I'm going to make the video. And then I'm going to have to give some examples of, like, how I was hypnotized to, like, draw and, like, you know, like, what, what it was supposed to mean, etc. Right. Um... So let's see here, um, sorry about like how weird I was acting, you know, like the hypnosis was really like inhibiting me a lot, um, and uh, okay, so I need to talk about some of the metaphors too, um, and describe those, and then, um, I'm like, because in the video I'm going to be showing some of the pictures as well, right? So I need to write this down for the video so that it's not like so difficult for me to speak during the video that I end up having to stop trying to make a video and then write it down first, right? Are you are you listening? Yeah, I'm okay. listening. Um <clears throat> hmm. Yes. Okay. Uh, no, I'm not okay. Like, you know, that's why I had to call you. I'm recording uh -huh. it. So that way, you know, like, um, there's evidence of it. Um, at least. But yeah, I, I need to get, like, uh, I need to reverse the post traumatic suggestions as soon as I possibly right. can because. 
<clears throat> this is not like okay. Um, like you know, I really wish they could just go to like an emergency room and like see like a hypnotherapist or something. You know what I mean? But it doesn't exactly work like that. They don't have that in the hospitals. Um. Which, I mean, like, that's something that we might end up having to do, but, um, you know, hopefully it doesn't become a common type of thing where we would have to have something like that. Mm -hmm. Um. I mean, you know, like, I could imagine it being, like, kind of a, an expensive emergency room bill or something like that. That would, um, basically be able to help, you know, hospitals to accommodate for situations like that if they end up coming up for, like, emergencies. Have it billed to, like, okay. insurance and everything like that. Because not necessarily any type of insurance company will cover hypnotherapy either. Like, Medicaid doesn't. I don't know if you knew that. Okay. Oh, so now you have to pay for it out of pocket. Um, like, uh, what, well, I mean, considering the situation, because it's like a life, um, like, I mean, it's like a, uh, like it's an involuntary situation, you know what I mean, that I'm in mm -hmm. right now, um, and, uh, you know, like it is a, it is a hazard directly to my health. And, uh, you know, um, there's literally no other medical alternative to treat it. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, uh, with being hypnotized not to drink water, the only thing that, like, they could literally do would be to hospitalize me and have me hooked up to an IV. And that's not, like, a realistic or practical solution to it. You know what I mean? That's also not cost-effective. So, um, wow, I've been like, you see how I've been talking in circles this entire time? This is what I mean by the hypnosis inhibiting me. Um, let's see. So all I really have to do shouldn't be very much because there is the drawings were very unusual and abnormal for threats of death. Um, the drawings were only related to death and were very abnormal for such content. Um... So I think I'm going to write that real quick. Like, the hypnosis, like, um, this should not be a difficult thing for me to do at all, but it feels so difficult to do. Um, the drawings were very unusual and abnormal. Um, for threats of death. Um, there are also some, like, religious patterns in the drawings where he's drawn a lot of crosses. Uh -huh. Um... And, uh, the, pa uh, like, uh, so the pattern with the drawings, too, um, like, uh, the, like, uh, they were very simple and easy to draw, which was just, like, what, you know, I was synthesized to do, because I'm not very much of an, like, a, you know, an artist or, you know, like, a talented drawer or anything like that. Um, so I wouldn't have done it unless it was very simple. Um, you know, like, basically, uh, the drawings were simple enough for anybody to draw. Mm -hmm. 
because this is basically putting a lot um a lot of that information in all at once um and uh referenced religion Okay, so I'm trying to write this as fast as I can, but like the hypnosis is making it extremely difficult. Um, let me see. Wow, the hypnosis I can't even write. Wow, that was bad. Did you notice how my voice got strained there? Uh-huh. Yeah, that's what I mean. So the drawings were very and what I think I'm going to write for that is, um, I'm going to start with a very simple, um, we're simple enough for anybody to be able to draw. And I need to specify in the letters too. Drawings and the letters were simple enough for anybody to do. I can't even write though. You keep on writing I, it in the new ring symbol? Um, well, not exactly. Uh, that would kind of happen a lot with the hypnosis, yes, but um, it's not the only thing that, like, uh, it, like, um, just. Trying to talk would feel strange. Just trying to get myself to, like, even start like looking at the notebook would feel strange. For example, right, and that's not normal. No, it's not. Yeah, and then bringing my pencil to the page was extremely strenuous too. The drawings and the letters were simple enough. For almost anyone to be able to draw. Several drawings. Referenced religion such as crosses. There we go. Ah. What? My eye itches. Oh, I'm sorry about that. It's okay. It happens. Um. None of the drawings um, reference the uh, death. None of the drawings were threatening or reference death. Well, I could just put none of the drawings were threatening. Um, and uh, they were very unusual and abnormal for, um, you know, based off the letter content. And were very unusual and abnormal. To be included in death threat letters.
that it raised suspicion for me. That he was hypnotized to draw the pictures. Like I was. Because... Uh, um, I could just even leave it at, like, uh, like I was, I guess, um, um, alright, so I need to think about how well written I have that sentence, sentence, and thinking about it is, like, also feeling strenuous, too. Does that make sense? Yeah. Because it shouldn't be. The drawings and the letters were simple enough for almost anyone to be able to draw several drawings reference religions such as crosses. None of the drawings were threatening and were very unusual and um, abnormal to be included in death threat letters that it raised suspicion for me that he was hypnotized to draw the pictures like I was. 